I'm recording. I'm recording. I'm putting that in the video. I'm putting that in the video. What do you have on your hair? The leave-in conditioner. Leave-in conditioner. Well, what do you know? I'm speaking about leave-in conditioner. So, yay! <laughs> have a lovely time, people watching the video. Welcome back to Cape Town Curly. I am going to show you my favorite leave-in conditioners today. So, as you know, I am that wash and go kind of girl. I love using my leave-in conditioner, my oils, and my creams. Um, I think that leave-in conditioners quintessential I love that word quintessential for any naturalist no matter what hair type you have no matter what your porosity is you love a good leave-in conditioners and today I'm going to show you a few of mine first up we have Cantu I love the Cantu Shea Butter leave-in I think it's one of those uh, leave-in conditioners that you don't have to layer really I know that I mentioned that I love to layer and I do but sometimes I'm kind of lazy and you know I don't have to always layer my products when I use the shea butter leave-in conditioner I feel that the product is heavy enough or nourishing enough for me to just start from the bottom move to the top and that's it. I don't need a curling cream or a gel or a mousse afterwards. I really, really love this product. However, you may not know this, but Cantu has another leave-in called the Argan Oil Leave-In Conditioner. Now, this product is not available in South Africa yet. It's in my top three. I love the Cantu Argan Oil. It is just fantastic. My hair loves Argan Oil and I think that's the reason why um, my curls are just softer and curlier and coilier and I I don't know it's just it's just on my top three hands down. I use my Argan Oil sparingly. It's, it's just it's just phenomenal. Next up, now you know I've got to mention a mention of African brand and my natural hair. <sighs> Ma'am, I've done a video on my natural hair, my wash and go with my natural hair, and the leave in, I, it blows me away all the time. It is one of my favorite leave in conditioners. It's, it's so, so, so good. It is nice and thick as well so if you a lazy naturalist such as myself you also don't need to layer it but it just performs better when you do layer the product check out my wash and go with my natural hair I will link it over here where is it over here well I'll link it for you to check it out okay next up we have the Shea Moisture a Jamaican black castor oil leave-in now when I first used this, when I first opened it up and smelt it, the smell kind of blows you away because it smells like castor oil, but man, doesn't do the job. First, also one of those products you don't need to use anything else if you use, and you don't need to use a lot of this product as well. It's a really, really good product. I love this one. It's one of my staples. All of the products that I'm showing you are my staples that I have with me in my closet. Um, some of them were sent to me, some of them I buy. Whenever I come to the end of a jar or bottle, I make sure that I'll go out and get them because these are really, really good products. The next one that I want to mention came as a surprise to me because um, it wasn't in the right aisle. So, you know, there shouldn't actually be any aisles, the wrong aisle or right aisle or... I think you know what I mean. But I think they're changing that as well. 
It's naughty. Now I didn't bother with this product until one of my 4C friends told me that she loves using the Naughty's Intensive Care Leave-In Conditioner. And I thought like, what? I didn't think that it was for my kind of hair. But then I gave it a try and it blew me away because it is so nourishing. Naughty doesn't have any um, parabens or sulfates in it and it's 97% natural. Now that's, that's, that's pretty damn good. Also has argan oil in it. Maybe that is the reason why my hair really loves this. But if you um, are looking for a good product, try Naughty's Leave-In. Um, it's really good. Next up, I want to mention Kyle's Daughter. This is their hair milk. It's a nourishing uh, and conditioning original leave-in moisturizer. Now, this one didn't really agree with me in the beginning. Um, it made my hair kind of hard, but then I discovered that Carol's Daughter is super, super concentrated, which means that the amount of product that I was using on my hair was in fact too much so um i met lisa price who is the owner of carol's daughter and she was in south africa recently and she loved south africa and i have to show you this clip i i just have to show you this clip this is lisa price <laughs> founder ceo queen of carol's daughter and will you please just look at her nails <laughs> lisa price came to slay south africa look at that that's amazing thank you thank you so much <laughs> so, <cool. laughs> so yeah that is lisa price owner of carol's daughter who loves south africa and um this product is definitely on my top 10. now next up is on Jackie's Quench. I have mentioned this product so many times and I will mention it again. Quench is one of my favorites. It makes my hair feel like butter or at least it melts into my hair like butter. Now Aunt Jackie's Quench has shea butter and olive oil in it and it also has marshmallow root. This one is much lighter than the other products that I've mentioned, the other leave-ins that I've mentioned. I prefer using this one in summer. My hair just seems to make love to this product. If you know what I mean, it's just so amazing. It just seeps into my hair, keeps it nourished and moisturized and um, yeah. And that's it. Those are some of my favorite leave-in conditioners that form part of my top 10. Um, if there is a leave-in conditioner that I did not mention, please do leave a comment down below. Tell me what your favorite is and I will give it a try. I will do a review. Um, I really appreciate you for watching. I am at 300 subscribers. Thank you so much. I'm so excited when I saw that. You know, when I saw the 299 go over to 300, I am super stoked. I love doing YouTube videos. But thank you so much for watching. Leave a comment down below. Click that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.